So for that rattle, basically what's happened is this is the blower down here. We have to take the front panel off to get to it. And we have to basically take some other stuff apart down there. But this is the blower. You can see that this, it has a spline sort of shaft area, whatever centerpiece. And that shaft has worn out on this old one. So we just replace this blower on this one and it will dry a lot more efficiently and it won't have that rattle. loose on the shaft that c-clip is in front of that holds the thing in place c-clip has to come off and you can pull the blower out this one's pretty busted up Where's the new one? clamp has to go back on and then the clamp goes over that and back together okay that's your tip for today thanks for watching uh, while you have it out you might want to lube the rollers you can lube the rollers from here without taking the uh, drum out or the belt off which is cool Okay, when you put the clamp on, make sure the clamp, the clamp edges are facing the flat spline on the shaft. That's the way that clamp goes on. So the flat spine on the shaft is over on this side, right by these, the ends of the clamp. This video is for informational purposes only. Working on appliances can be hazardous. If you need a professional, contact your local professional directly. If this video helped you, please send me a donation. Bill's Recycling Enterprises, P.O. Box 7021, Eureka, California, 95502. I can coach you over the phone for a fee, 707-443-8347. I also have a How to Make Money in the Appliance Repair uh, online course. It involves a year of coaching. I'll give you personal coaching and a link to over 100 videos. If you're interested, uh, contact me.